So we, we had to bring a better TV. Oh my TV. god! <laughs> you so much. This is incredible. Hello and good morning everyone. Might be the last hello and good morning you get from me for the next three days. It's okay, we can do this. It's gonna be good. You guys, we will. Yeah, Hazy, can you take care of my hello and good morning for everyone? <laughs> yes. That would probably make them so happy. They would probably actually like it more than they like seeing me every morning. What do you think? Yeah. I think so. This girl's heading into her last week with a cast. This cast, this not a cast. Okay, let's rewind things, you guys. Woke up at the early, early hour today. Got Ryler off to his camp out, you guys. He is completely ready. He looks awesome. He feels good. He's excited. We're excited for him. I cannot believe he's actually gone. He's gonna be heading up in the mountains for five days and he is going to be living off of the fish that he catches and he is going to be living off of everything that he has packed on his back. His pack today was 45 pounds and that's about what everybody's pack was. So that was really good. It was a little lighter last night but we added in his sleeping bag and his three liters of water that he has packed in his bag. He's got everything he needs. I'm so excited for him. Him and all of his friends are headed up into the mountains of Wyoming. They're going to be backpacking through the mountains. I cannot wait for him to come back and tell me all the stories of all the things they learned, of all the stuff they caught, all the animals that they saw. It's going to be an adventure for him. He's going to come back with, I'm sure, life experiences that he'll never forget. I'm also about to head off. I actually have to, before I leave, take this girl to dance. In fact, we need to be walking out the door right now. So grab your backpack, we'll head out. I'm gonna get her to dance while she's there. I'm gonna go pick up some stuff from Costco. Easy meals for Brandon and the kids to have while I'm gone and just take care of a few loose ends for them. Pizza all day. Oh, right, right. I'm gonna miss all of you. I'll try to send a few little clips of what I'm doing to keep you guys up to date. It's gonna be awesome. Just got back, went and got a couple, just a few, because I know the kids are gonna wanna do their own thing. The kids absolutely love this stir fry meal from Costco, and they ended up getting the meatloaf one. Brexton and crew love that one. You love that one too? Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's a fan favorite. Kids all love the meatloaf and the teriyaki stir fry from Costco. I got those for them, a couple other things to keep them stocked for the week. I just got home and I have to pack up the car and get ready to leave. So I've got all my little bags of everything that I need. I'm gonna be loading that car. Just like that, mom is gone. She's off for the week, off on her retreat. She is set to go for a fun week with some of the young women here in the neighborhood. Ragai, as you saw, is gone on his high adventure. In fact, I believe they've started their climb, their actual hike after a four hour drive. They'll be hiking for eight miles into base camp, another four or five hours of hiking. I'm just crossing my fingers, saying my prayers that he is having a great time, making a lot of memories and coming back with some phenomenal stories. But you guys, those are only two of three enormous things going on today. Third and potentially biggest is Maddie is moving out, you guys. She is moving officially into college, starting her second Second year in college. She's beginning in the summer semester, decided to go back a little bit early. So we're moving her into her new apartment today. We've loaded up her stuff here. We're gonna do some grocery shopping. We're gonna grab some additional supplies from Home Depot, Ross, all the things that she's gonna need to survive in college. Her car is also full. This car is full here and in there. So we're gonna head off right now to P-Town, Provo. Not Providenciales, unfortunately, but Provo, Utah. She'll be attending BYU. We're super, super excited for her. We're sad that she was only here for a couple of nights, but she is just now down the road, which is phenomenal. Anytime she wants to come home, she can jet home. She can come home and swim. She can watch a movie with her friends. She can just come over for some Sunday dinner if she wants because she is that close and we love that. We have just unpacked, unloaded, and moved Maddie into Sufficial. her new place. That was so easy. She had yeah. two roommates and one of her roommate's moms here and they all helped out. It was like so it really fast. Many hands make light work or yeah. whatever. It was crazy because crew did a lot of the loading himself to the truck. And so it took him a lot of trips up and down the stairs. And then Crushed we it. show up here like five minutes later, the entire thing's unloaded. She's yeah. moved in. She's got her bed on cinder block. She's ready to rock. <laughs> because it's we're happening. dropping her off right here. You're just down the road. This isn't like a very yeah. major goodbye, but you are officially sleeping here tonight, yeah. moving in here, getting packed, I'm organized. closer than I was before though. Not the Dominican Republic, not California. But you're closer than you've almost ever been in your life. Yeah. So aside from being 
in the basement. This is about as close as we can ever hope to have you. Now we're gonna be seeing a lot of Maddie's coming over for dinners. Right next to us. Yeah, which this is, is the I know. And the best is being next to us, right? That's and like the best. I will be next. To yeah, you we need her there at the, the pool. Time. We need her watching movies with us, snuggling, and eating dinner yeah. at the kitchen table. And it's summer. So we got a lot. We're gonna of live it up. A lot of fun. Yeah. Chill vibes here at school, you know, just taking it easy, having a good time. We're so excited for all the adventures that lie ahead for you here at BYU. We're so proud of you and all your hard work and getting into the school and Thanks. immediately coming back right after your mission. I mean, you're not skipping a beat. No. Kind of a hard worker. <laughs> Hugs. Love you. Hazel. Hugs. Love you. Just dropped off Maddie. She just got moved into her place. And while we were doing some of the moving in and the kids were all done, we were settling, organizing some things into the kitchen. They let these boys watch some TV on mm -hmm. their TV. Yeah, we were watching Mr. Yeah. Beast. Yeah, they were. They actually saw that Sam has brought a Nintendo Switch. She said that she brought it so that she could game with these guys because they clan up in Fortnite sometimes. Squad up, whatever you call it. Yeah. But anyways, they get together and they drop in in Fortnite. And we we're like, that is so dang cool. Here's the problem, you guys. I think it's like a 22 inch Toshiba 480p. I just feel like we need to step up her entertainment game a little bit. You know, if she's gonna be watching oh, Netflix, yeah. she's gonna be watching these vlogs. You can watch on YouTube, Mr. Beast. She's gonna be squatting up with you guys in Fortnite. She needs a better television yeah. system. Yeah. So, these days, you guys, flat screens, very affordable. We just found an insane deal on a 50 inch 4K UHD TV at Walmart. It's a Vizio, it's gorgeous, it's 50 inches, full 4K. Told her we we're going back home, we we're leaving, but we're actually not. We we're right back at Walmart where we got the groceries. We're gonna snag yep. the TV, they have one in stock, and then we're gonna go surprise her with it. Let's do it! Let's go! <laughs> We cannot have Sam squatting up with us on that TV. <laughs> so we, we had to bring a better oh TV. Oh my god! Thank you so yeah. much. <laughs> it was incredible. The kids are watching Mr. Beast on it, and I was like, I can't be what you guys watch movies on. <laughs> so we got you this instead. <laughs> Yeah, you're welcome. You're so welcome. Nice. You guys are so sweet. You're so appreciative. And I measured before I left because I was a little nervous, and it fits, so it will fit width wise. I can't believe you're here right so, yeah. now. I know. <laughs> the door opens, and Maddie's just laying there, like, who is it? Like, yeah, I thought it was like one of Ella's friends. Yeah. I when just I heard your coming. voice, I was like, what? <laughs> We're gonna make a joke with Sam. We're like, hey, if you're gonna bring a switch out, you can't squat up in Fortnite on that. TV. Oh man, she's not so, here. She doesn't get the joke, but it's fine. I've we'll been... tell it to her. Yeah, yeah. Just tell her that's why. Yeah. Her. There you go. Man, it's Enjoy. So it's, uh, yeah, 50 inch 4K, so you should be uh, for watching on Netflix and hanging out. So. <laughs> oh, it's already on. It oh, my God. oh, she just plugged it in. There you go. Boom. <laughs> We have successfully got so many things done and accomplished today. We've got Maddie off at college in her apartment. She has moved in, settling in, enjoying her new TV, enjoying her fun time with her roommates. Yeah, and also what was awesome, that we're actually gonna do my hair stuff tomorrow, so that saved us time. And we were able to get Ryan Guy off on his adventure, and from what I understand, they have reached base camp, our setting up camp. He actually was able to call us after mile four. He was four miles in, had a few miles left to go. Told us it was hard, but he was getting there. He was making it. We are so proud of him. Mom, I'll just put this out there because she'll correct me in a week anyway. She was the first one to get the call. She was the first one to find out. She told me, and then rather called me after that. But mom has also reached her destination. They have got all, I'm gonna call it checked in. It's not a hotel, but they're into the house, got all their stuff in. They're having a ton of fun. We are here. We sent Ryler off on his adventure. We sent mom off on her adventure. We sent Maddie off on her adventure in college. Yep. And whoo, we're finally back home. We can enjoy and do some things here in the house ourselves. And we <laughs> picked up some random junk stuff when we were out with Maddie today. Picked some things that we saw as we were walking around that looked good to have a snack on while Frosting, mom was gone. Animal crackers, one of them Ardos. is rainbow chip frosting, dipping animal crackers in it. One of our all-time fave combos. Although we also love the graham crackers, so the kids yeah. grab that. Got three cereals that we love. Spaghetti and meatballs for me and Hazy yes, tonight. Mega stuff. stuff Oreos. Some very easy to make mac mm. and cheese. Cheeto mac and cheese. Okay, we tried that This syrup? one's fruity cereal syrup. No, what is it, like a spread? Like a spread. Yeah, yeah. So like a tried, spread, yeah. We tried it, I loved it, but the flakes. Well, weird, huh? Yeah. This is what we picked up for ourselves while we were out shopping for Maddie today. Maddie, of course, picked up some baby spinach. Mom also, while she was out this morning, running some errands, maybe she showed this already, I have not 
not seen what she shot today. She, oh, gotta remember these guys. We also snagged these while we were out because I was gonna eat oh, those yeah. tonight, can't forget. <laughs> but mom went out and got some of the best things at Costco. Ready-made meals that the kids have asked for. So we've got meatloaf one night. We're gonna do one of their favorite beef stir fries. Oh no, it's not beef, it's a chicken stir fry. Yummy noodles that the kids love. So she got that for us because they're very easy dinners to make. She made it very simple for us. We took care of the snacks, she took care of the meals. We've also got a good healthy stocking of dino nuggets, soft pretzels, mini pancakes, frozen ice pizzas, cream. ice cream. So I think we're going to survive. I think we're gonna make it without mom here. We're settling in for dinner tonight, cozying up by a movie. Got it on our PJs. Still yes, like totally comfy. a movie tonight. I say a movie tonight. For actually tonight what he wanted was flaming Hot Mac and Cheese. So he picked that out of himself. <laughs> He's making flaming Hot Mac and Cheese. You guys love their I spice. Know, I love this one. And I told Rag Guy that I will be wearing this every night. This is the sweatshirt that we have that matches the sweatshirt that we got together in Disneyland. The Miles Morales hoodie. He's not wearing this. He's got much better camping gear. It's very thin, very lightweight, very protective against the elements, against rain, mosquitoes, dirt, all those things. This would probably not do well out there, but I'm going to wear it in memory and honor of him this week. I said every night, bro, I'm going to throw it on. I expect to see this one at the end of every day. We support Rag Guy through this epic high adventure, hiking through the mountains. Once they set up their base camp, the next step is that they will be hiking out every day, making a day hike to different lakes and fishing for their meals, for what they eat, surviving off the land. So I am very anxious to hear how it all goes. It was great to hear Riley's voice, to hear that he was doing okay. I could just hear the positivity in his voice and the attitude that he had. I could hear the smile through the phone and that made me smile, made me feel good about everything going on. It was so great to get Maddie moved in, see her smile, see her reunited with her friends, her adorable reaction to getting the new TV, watch some of their favorite shows, maybe invite some friends over, just enjoy binging and vegging through the summer semester. And mom seems to be having a good time. She has said that she misses us pretty bad and we miss her as well. But you guys- I just service because I've been texting her. <laughs> Guys, let's say we dive into some of these fun snacks, treats, dinners. Mm. Hopefully we don't have too bad of a stomach ache after. Yeah. Oh boy, there's Brexies right there. <laughs> We're gathering here in Hazy's room and the boys are gonna hang out with Hazy tonight. They're gonna have a full squad sleepover in here. So Kruby's sleeping on the trundle that pulls off from underneath Hazy's bed. Brexton has taken over the couch and made it his bed. I love that you guys are all up here together. Need anything? I'll be downstairs all by myself in my bed. I do miss mom. We miss mom like crazy. We are so darn excited for all of the fun that they're having, that Rag Guy's having, that Maddie's gonna be having. Can't wait to hear about all their stories and their adventures and all the things that we do while they're gone. Looks like the weather might be taking a turn for like the hot, hot. Getting hotter and hotter, temperatures are getting up into the 80s and 90s, so we've got some good summer weather coming. A lot of other really big things happening this week. Hazy Girl's going to get her hair done tomorrow, going to like a yes, salon with her cousin. cousin. And so they might be wearing matching outfits, we're not sure. We're gonna have to wait and see. Now mom actually has laid out every outfit of the day for the days that she has gone for Hazy right there. So they're all in a row. And I'm learning some very, I don't know, things that I took for granted. Sweet Hazy, I keep putting her shirts on wrong because you have to do the broken arm first. And I will just put her head in. And then the other arm. And then I'll go to the arm. She goes, no dad, you gotta do the arm first. And I'm like, oh, how can I forget this every single time? It's a work in progress, but Hazy. How you take it off, you do this arm, the head, then. Hazy gets it, she knows. So you finish with the cast, you're putting it on, you start with the cast. I'm learning it, these guys are learning it, and we're doing it together and we're loving every single second of you guys. So we're going to say good night here in Hazy's room. These kids are getting into bed. Dad's going to get working and we will see you guys again tomorrow for some yep. epic fun. A lot of great things going down. Thanks for hanging with us and wishing everybody well on their adventures. We love you and we'll see you tomorrow. Good night everybody. Bye. <laughs> you got it? Nice job. <laughs> now we can squat up. <laughs>